Hi Leo, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading for the month of May. So I bet you guys thought it was never going to come, right? You thought it was never going to come. Here it is. Here it is. So here it is. This is for Leo. What do we got for Leo? Light bulb. I just turned that light on for you. So you know what light is. Light is happiness. So happiness, right? Happiness is coming, obviously. Divine timing. You had to wait for it. Here it is. Maybe it's just seeing the light. Maybe you're getting that light bulb moment. I don't know. Something is coming to light. Something that is something is coming to light. Something is happening that is going to shine some light on a situation. And you know, light is positive. Light is happiness. So happiness is coming. Oh yeah, see this is getting over a painful situation. Healing from a painful situation. Healing from a painful separation. Ten of Pentacles. I mean, this Ten of Pentacles, this is building a new foundation or having a strong, solid foundation. It's the end of struggle. If you've been struggling financially, if you've been struggling um, with saving or whatever, this, this is like the end of it. Things should be starting to get better. If it's not financial, this could be at home. Your home life could be starting to get better. The Hermit. This is seeing the light. Somebody has been enlightened. Well, there's, there could be a snake in your path. But then again, that's in the shape of infinity. Be careful, okay? Just be careful, okay? You really need to look at a situation. Make sure that you are seeing everything. Something may appear to be a snake, but that could be your own thoughts. I mean, I don't know. It may not be really what you think it is if you look beyond the surface. Somebody has come a really, really, really long ways. Look at the path that has already been traveled. Okay, somebody has come a long ways and they, if they've run into something. It's a time of reflection. You've been through a time of reflection. And now you've got this. You've got something right in front of you that may not appear to be what it really is. Hmm. That is a conscious awareness, though. Maybe you know this. Maybe you already know that... Hmm. something isn't what it is this nine of pentacles reverse this is somebody who may have experienced some financial loss they didn't save their money they didn't bank their money now this is the future position so you may be still you know now this is this is the single independent person somebody may be going their own way and becoming single they may be deciding that, you know, this can go many different ways. This could go in another direction, too. This could state that you won't be single for long. This could be that you've gotten into a new partnership. You're no longer single or you're not going to be single for long. But this could also mean that you are deciding to go your own way. Um, because this is a loner. Interesting. So this could go either way because this could, this guy's like seeing an opportunity, I think. We got somebody here that is seeing an opportunity to either become single or come out of hermit mode, whichever one it is. This is this is a stable, solid foundation right here, but it's the very beginning because tens are completions. So if you've been struggling, it's I think it's just about over. Okay? I do. Mm. Yeah, something is going to become made clear. This is the seeing the light. So something is going to 
be made clear. Ooh, might have to do with a partnership, okay? And this is choose wisely. And you know, there's a snake in this one, too. What? <laughs> Listen. There's something going on here. Um... This is, we're talking about light. We've been talking about the light. And then the lights go out and they come back on. I mean, this is... The shit that has been happening is out of control in this household. So, anyway... Um, it's not electrical. It's all kinds of different things. I just gotta think about this for a second. Gather my thoughts. Um... <laughs> Somebody's making a decision. They're seeing the light. The light keeps going on and off. Okay? It does. Obviously. You, I mean, this is unbelievable. Anyway, and this is what happened to me. My lights have not flickered since I don't even know when. So, whatever. Anyhow. Somebody is definitely seeing the light in regards to a partnership. Somebody could be deciding to, you know, something could become exposed. Okay, this is being exposed, some truth being exposed. So, Leo, just beware, okay? The moon is beware, you know. Oh, my God. Yep. Yeah, somebody may be thinking about walking away or thinking about going back. I mean, that is, this is thinking about walking away from a partnership that may not be stable and going towards something more stable. You know, I feel like you guys have put in a lot of hard work into a situation. You've, you're probably just about to give up on a partnership. Somebody that's just about to give up if they haven't given up already. Light bulb moment. I said it at the very beginning of this reading, and the lights just went out. Whatever. Oh my God. I can't get over it. There's an opportunity for happiness here. This is happiness at home. This is home, family, happiness. This is, this, this is be happy. Be happy. This is your approach. This is your future, though. Somebody is, somebody may be walking away, I have to be honest, whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with. And now this, when I say person, it doesn't have to be a love relationship. It could be a family dynamic. I, I don't know. Somebody in the family, I don't know. Somebody is walking away. They're making a decision to go their own way. So I don't know who this is. This is. This is. Gold. This is. So it's like somebody is seeing a snake. Okay. So just be careful. Be careful. Beware. You may have gotten yourself involved in a false beginning. And now you're seeing the light. Oh, I'm sorry. But there's an opportunity for happiness. And this is, this is, you, you know, family is where it's at. Family is where it's at. As long as you have your family, and I know people are going to say, oh, no, my family, I hear you, I hear you. Family doesn't always support you, and I understand that completely. Um, but you've come so far. You have come so far, and I feel like, you know, it's time for you to heal from whatever this is. Okay, that Three of Swords is unhappy family situation. Somebody is not in a happy family situation or a happy relationship or something there's like there's no abundance here there's um there may have been some overindulging there may have been some um secrets okay there, there probably was some secrets some but anyway and they may have presented themselves to be the ultimate wish fulfillment i mean that's a true snake right so i think that you may have somebody may have maybe dealing with somebody or have or is probably dealing with somebody who is no longer leading to happiness and they're needing to you know or they're thinking about walking away um now we have this empress i'm i know what i'm worth 
the empress knows what I'm worth. Now, this could be heading towards an empress as well. So whether you're the female watching this or you're the male watching this, we have an empress here who knows her worth. This is a beautiful, compassionate soul who gives birth to a new life. She can create anything. She can grow anything. She nurtures everything. She takes care of herself. She doesn't chase opportunities. Opportunities chase her. So. We have a woman. This is a woman. that knows her worth and I believe that this woman is focusing on her family she needs to focus on her her family maybe she needs to focus on being a mother right now maybe that's supposed to be the main focus this is the focus and I put this right there maybe your main focus is to be a mother right now if you are the female If you are the male, you this is a mother. Whoever you're dealing with is a mother and she has family, she has children, she has th things to take care of and she's very strong. She's dealt with a lot of pain in her life and she will walk away. This woman will walk away from a false partnership. So whether this is you or the, the person that you're dealing with, we have a woman here that knows her worth and she may be thinking about walking away from a home relationship that is no longer stable. There's no wish fulfillment there. I'd be better off on my own. It's like she's seeing the light. There's an opportunity for happiness. She can do it by herself. She may have thought she couldn't do it by herself, but she can. So I don't know who that reading is for, that part. If you are the male watching this, you may be thinking about heading towards this empress. This is a Taurus or a Libra, uh, Libra. but it, obviously it could be you. Could be, it could be you. You are very nurturing. You are very creative. You are very loving. You are very generous. <laughs> This could absolutely be you if you are the female. But if you are the male, if you are the male, you are dealing with an empress and you are probably, you know, and this could be your mother if you are the male. This could be your mother that is saying, focus on your family, focus on the children. You know, this could be your mother. Um, I'm not sure. This could even be your mother walking away from a situation. I don't know. This is no longer crying over the loss, no longer crying over the spilled milk, realizing that you have a better opportunity. Find the strength to stand back up because it's time to live again. So anyway, this is an opportunity that perhaps you were ignoring or you weren't seeing or you were too focused on a loss to realize that there is still an opportunity for wish fulfillment somewhere. There's an opportunity to get what you deserve, and I think that you reap what you sow, and I feel like um, somebody is getting what they deserve, whether it's good or bad. Somebody is getting exactly what they deserve because you reap what you sow. Now, this is also receiving something, receiving something that is going to bring balance to your life. Some of you may be receiving money. You may be, you may feel like you can't take care of it on your own. You may feel like you're going downhill. You may feel like, you know, you made some poor decisions and you overspent or something like that, you know, you, but you may be receiving some sort of money from somebody to help you. This could be your mother. Your mother may give you some money. So if you are the Leo, you, somebody may be helping you to, you know, make a better choice. They want you to be happy. So maybe it's your mother that wants you to be happy and they, they're going to help you. So I don't know. I don't know. I feel as though there's an opportunity for a new beginning here because the Empress gives birth to a new life. But I have to be honest with you. It's after a a partnership or a union that is not compatible okay 
this is incompatible. Two of, two of cups. There's too much arguing. There's too much incompatibility. There's really no union here. At one, but there may be assets involved, and that could be one of the reasons why somebody's just thinking about it and they're not taking action. Maybe it's because of the home. Maybe it's because of the assets. You know, but this is making the decision this month. So I think that somebody is making a decision. Perhaps it's a tough one because there's children involved. There's definitely some children involved, but this is clinging to the past, clinging to the memories. This is you, uh, miserable. This I'm sorry, not trying to put you down, but the Queen of Wands in reverse is somebody who was feeling miserable down in the dumps. Um, lack of energy, lack of drive, loss of ambition bringing you down. You may be dealing with a person that is bringing you down. They're stealing your energy. This is not finding the strength. So you're thinking about walking away, but somebody is not. There's no strength here. I'm sorry, but we all know Leo is the strength card and it represents the Queen of Wands and it's reversed. Somebody is not finding the strength and the courage to let go of the this is the memories of the past. Let go of, I mean, to let go and it could be because of children. Somebody may be holding on to a foundation just for the children but there's no abundance there anyway maybe and it could be for the children because I'm afraid about not having enough money but that not that hermit is is reflecting it's going within to you know it's becoming self-aware it's becoming consciously aware that the time is now if you think about the infinity sign the time is now you have the power so I feel like you do have the power to start this new life because she gives birth to a new life. You have the power to keep going. You have the power to take care of yourself. But there's lack of courage and confidence and strength. Yep. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of back and forth. There's probably a lot of um, fighting going on maybe at home. Maybe you're maybe you're afraid. Maybe you're afraid, and you got to protect yourself. Maybe you're really afraid of, you know, what will happen if you, you know, go your own way. For some of you, um, well, this is a good one. Don't let yourself get distracted. This is an opportunity to go in a new passionate direction. This is an opportunity to leave this misery behind. This is this is an this is um, the page that asks you to stay focused. Don't get distracted. I feel like something is coming to fruition that you started a long time ago, and now you're going to be, you're receiving something. You have an opportunity to let the, let the let the, let the, let the hurt go, to stop crying over the loss, to you know. Go after what you deserve at this time. This is an exciting new opportunity to move forward. And this is this could be with somebody that is very well suited for you. So this is a suitor that is really, really good for you. This person could be a little bit younger than you. Um, this could be another fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um... I think that something, this is like taking a new approach, going down a new path with excitement. This is an exciting opportunity to take a new adventure, to start your new life. So I think that right now a lot of you are making a decision. I think it's been a tough decision, a very tough decision. I think there's been a lot of back and forth. There's been a lot of battling, inner battling. I think that there's fears of, of uh, being alone. You know, I don't want to be alone. Definitely fears of being alone here. Be loneliness is big with these two cards. So, <laughs> you're going to need to find the strength and the courage to hold your head up high and go after what you deserve. So I think that this month is a month about making a decision. This is making the decision.
The challenge is going after what you deserve. Right now, right now, right now, somebody, this is right now, right in the middle here, right now, somebody is not in a happy partnership. There's lack of reciprocation or there's lack of love or there's fighting. There's definitely fighting. Okay. Um, and there's an opportunity for a rebirth. Okay. She gives birth to something new. But you got to struggle through the pain. You think about the empress. The empress is the mother. She gives birth. She That is the empress. So it, to get to that reward, you get a reward. You have to give birth, and to give birth, it's painful. So somebody's going to be dealing with a painful release, and then they're going to get a reward. Don't stay in the darkness, just like that light. It's, it's, it's time. It's time. You've come so far. Don't look back now. Keep going. Follow the light. Go after your happiness. Do not let anybody hold you back. The time is right now. So I honestly believe that during the month of May, if it hasn't happened already, somebody is going to have a light bulb moment that I know my worth. I deserve balance and harmony. I deserve reciprocation. I can't keep crying over this loss. It's time to be happy. They could be deciding to move, move home. This is an exciting new adventure. Probably with somebody that is pretty well suited for you. But anyway, Leo, I feel like that this is a month of making that decision to take the high road. And that's what I got.